Hey guys, JC123 Adam here, and I'd like to welcome you to another episode of My Towncraft. And we are in the middle of a thunderstorm. Oop, I took damage. Ouch. Um, we are right in the middle of a thunderstorm here on My Towncraft. Ooh, it's a little bit too close. Which is kind of unfortunate because uh, <laughs> it was sunny once today started, and now we are back with a nice little, wonderful, little, wonderful, lovely thunderstorm. But as you can see, I am not in either Pepsiville or... Power City. I am currently in a new town. That's right. I told you guys yesterday on the Hunger Games video, or not the Hunger Games, the mini games video, that we are no longer have a. Oh, what was I going to say? Um, the survival is down, otherwise, this would be up yesterday. But that's right. I am currently standing in Stone Hill. I live here now. I have a shop here. The JC's Cottage Company is going well. I've had a couple commissions, including some from this town right here, uh, which I finished up. Um, and maybe I'll get around at some point if I want to. Ooh, you're a skeleton. You have to die, die, die. Die, 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 die. die. You're a zombie. You can die, too. You can die, too, zombie. Thank you. I'll t I, won't, I don't need your rotten flesh. I'll stop by the container later. So, if you look over there, that, bu that building with all the glass and everything, that is my current shop. <laughs> That's right, I have a shop here for my cottage, and this is much nicer than the one I have in Pepsiville, because I'm on a larger lot. 15 by 15. Oh, hi! Yeah, this is my cat. Um, so... If I'm correct... That's right, yeah, the book's still here. Good. Um, so... We're gonna do this. I'm gonna go here. Welcome to JC's Cottage Company, where you can purchase one of our many fine cottages. This company is founded on my fun crafts, as a way to provide affordable housing solutions to everyone who didn't want to build their own home. We hope you choose to use our service. If you want to arrange a tour of one of our houses, contact me, jc 3 Adam. In fact, I'm so sure that you'll like what you see. I live in two of these cottages myself. You may be asking yourself, how can I acquire one of these fine dwellings? Well, simply... I got a spelling mistake. Simply fill out the order form over towards the material list and you can place an order there. Prices will be discussed with jc 3 Adam before... Construction begins. Disclaimer. By agreeing to purchase a cottage from JC123 Adam, you understand that. You also agree to pay within two days of it being built. Should you choose not to pay, the cottage will be dismantled. Warnings are sent out the day before the cottage is taken down. Do not take these books. To whoever took my books before, give them back. I want them back. I want them back. I'm kidding. You can keep them now. I have a new ones. Thank you for choosing JC's Cottage Company. And yes, yeah, so my cottage company is going well, and they just co- and when they're done with the book, for those of you that took this, when you're done with the book, jump, and it just falls right back in the dispenser. And if we go over here, as we can see, I have no orders yet, which is fine by me. Um, ooh. let's see if I can get this back in there. Go on. There you go. Is it back in? Yeah, it's back in there. Okay, and we have materials donation, which I'm happy to say that I've had many donations so far, so much I had to put in a double chest. Um, so we're gonna dig, so let's take a look down there, we're gonna dig, oh, jump, dig down one more, and see, I've got a whole bunch of donations. These were from the co-mayor, Woe, of this, because somebody took the book, and he wanted to make sure I didn't run out of any more, so thank you, Woe, very much, and thank you to everybody else who donated to my shop. Um, whoa, Lag Spike City. Lag Spike City. Whoa. Hoo hoo hoo. Stop lagging. Stop lagging. I did nothing to you. Uh. Anytime you want to stop lagging, you can. Hold on. Let me try something. Let's see if I can get this to stop lagging for us. Uh, we'll keep it on fancy. Um. We'll turn. Uh, particles to decreased. Server texture is fine, that's fine. Clouds, let's turn you off. Uh, and let's give it to minimum smooth lighting. Yeah, I don't really notice the difference or anything with this, so... Let me look. That... There we go, increased our frame rate, and we are done lagging. And see, everything's alright, so... Here we are, and hey, there's Ivy Indigo right there. That's right, she did a filming on the server earlier, so I'll go check out her channel right there. Matter of fact... Where is she going? Is she going to my shop? Are you going to my shop, Ivy? I think you're going to my shop. <laughs> you're going to my shop, aren't you? Yeah. Oh, you saw nothing. <laughs> oh, she's still there. She's still there. <laughs> No, 
run away, run to the ocean, run to the ocean, run to the ocean. Did I lose her? <laughs> Did I lose her? Got a baby zombie around here somewhere. Oh, it's an itty bitty little cutie putty baby zombie who needs die. I love the suckers. Anyway, so today, oh, the lag is back again. Oh, I guess we'll give it back to fast. Everything seems to be going back again, so that's good. Uh, we're back to fast lighting. Um, I can deal with fast. If not, there's one more thing I can change, which I don't want to change, but that's fine. But as you can see, we're running around my town craft, um, or my fun craft, and I really like Stonehill so far. They've got a lot of cool things, um, so much stuff, which is a lot of fun. I love the server so much. And since we're on the town hall, uh, I think it's only my job to show you, if you decide to live in Stonehill, which you can live next to me in one of my fine cottages. Uh, I'm kidding. And, of course, Ivy's, which is off about. Okay, so we're going to be um, heading down the stairs to platform two. Okay. They have a subway system, guys. Yeah, this is the city. This is the future. So we're going to go to the beach. Whee! Wee! I think it's awesome they have a subway system here. See, you can see me riding in the subway. And I'm just on my way to the office, dear. Oh, we're here. Okay. And while I'm here, might as well show you guys that this rail right here, once you get back here, goes to the farms. So we'll take this one over to the farms. Wee! Wee! Oops, my voice cracked a little bit. So, and they've got, I think, a little nice devotion to the nether. And this goes to the town hall. That goes to the town mine. We're going to be going back to the town hall. I might show you the town mine in a little bit. Um, and they have something else I have to show you here on the server, which I think is pretty cool. They have a theme park. And next week I have to ma make sure to film this, because they're going to be filming a... Uh, um, they're going to be holding a celebration because I was their 50th resident, which is awesome. Absolutely fantastic. So, um, because I was their 50th resident, they were throwing a celebration in my honor. I'm kidding. I don't want it to be in my honor. Um, but right now I want to go to home two. So, we're back home. There's the cottages I built across the street. There's Ivy's cottages in there. And she's got a bunch of cats in there, crazy old cat lady. <laughs> um... And like I said, they have a theme park. They have an actual legitimate theme park down here. So we're going to go jump, 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 jump. Ooh. I took some damage there when I was jumping. And there's many things you can do. They recommend you put your stuff in the ender chest, which I also recommend. And, oh, there's an enderman. Speaking of ender, and... Oh, I know you're coming for me, spider. So... Cool guys, don't look at explosions. <laughs> okay, so, but see that monster right there? That thing looks like a giant gray snake. That, my friends, is their mountain climber thriller coaster, which we are about to jump on. Take a ride on. No, I want to get on. I want to. I almost. Good thing I was standing right there, otherwise, that thing would have left without me. So, here we are. And we're going to be riding this coaster all the way up there. I don't remember if that's up or down, but this coaster is awesome. I love going on it. And once again, you can see me riding it. Whee! Whee! Oh, I can see my house from here. I can see that entire block, in fact. Oh, my cottages look so fantastic. I love it. Um, so, while we're riding this, how are you guys doing? Did you have a good day? Do my videos end off your day or start your day? 
Uh, okay, that's interesting. Um, anyway, <laughs> oh, it's snowing up here now. I guess we're, yeah, we're high in the mountain, so yeah, it's snowing. Oh, there's a bunch of lag spikes here, there, and everywhere. Oh, we're stopped up here. I guess this is where you want to get off, if you're scared to go down this hill. But we're not scared! We. Oh! <laughs> oh man, I remember the first roller coaster I ever rid was at Six Flags New England. My friends convinced me to do it as far as my senior class trip. My friends convinced me to do it, and I usually hate roller coasters, but I got on this one. I first time I got on this, I was like when I first got on it, I was like, why the hell do I let you psychopaths talk me into this? And then I was like then I started saying, if we die on this, I'm going to kill you. And then by the end I was maniacally laughing, so everything was all good. Oh, okay, so there's my minecart. Oh, you decide you want to kill me. I'll kill you, kill your children. That's right, you better run. Showed him. <laughs> Imagine if you could get turned into a zombie in Minecraft. Just, just ponder that for a moment. And there's headshot. Hi, head. Oh, this is one I haven't tried over here yet. Looks to be a dartboard. I'm not sure exactly how you play if it's even up yet. Um, but we'll try it anyway. Um, hold on. <laughs> Caps. Oh, while well, we're waiting for him to do that, um, there's a parkour map I plan to show you guys today, um, I'm horrible at parkour, you guys all know this, I don't expect too much to come out of it, but it should be a lot of fun. Also, guys, um, at the end of August and the beginning of September, my classes start up again, so, oh, same as regular darts, um, okay, so I'm assuming I need a bow, and I only have two arrows with me, um, so, let's go for that one right there, uh, Hey! Bullseye on the first try! Woo! -hoo -hoo. <laughs> wow, I can't believe I did that. Just wow. <laughs> first try! First try, I got that bullseye, and I hit the button. I didn't think I would. Honestly, I thought I wouldn't do it. Um, but how many points is that? A bullseye? <laughs> Ivy wants to come see it. She doesn't believe me. <laughs> Why you no believe me, Ivy? And she apparently she didn't watch my video last night, which I'm kind of disappointed about, because she always watches my videos. Ivy, why didn't you watch my video last night? Why couldn't you watch that video? So they're not interesting anymore. Did you get bored of me? Did you, Ivy? Tell me. Oh, no. Ivy's great. Um, <laughs> but there's that bullseye right there. <laughs> oh, it looks like it despawned. Uh, I guess I'll try to get it again. Oh. Ivy, you stood in my way. You jinxed me. You jinxed me, Ivy. I think the light lighting up classifies as a bullseye. So... <laughs> yes! <laughs> so let's try another shot. Just one more. Then I think I'll be done.
Let's bring that down right there, and boom. No, one more shot. Boom. Oh, that sucks. <laughs> Ivy, you jinxed me! I was doing so well, too, I could have gotten two more if you hadn't come by. <laughs> um, so, I'm going to try the new parkour map. And I think that may or not may not round up the episode. We might do a little miniature tour of Millionaire's Avenue towards the end, because there's some stuff that's been updated on it. I know it's not the most interesting thing for you guys to watch, and you guys have kind of voiced that out to a little bit. I'm sorry, um, but I'm going to go try the parkour map for a few minutes, and I'll see you when I get over there. So, as you guys can see... Ooh, we're lagging a little bit. So, as you guys can see, we are back in the survival server. This was, um, Hunger Games. Um, I played that only once on the server. It's not really that interesting for me, because not as many people played the server. Though we had, like, 20 people on today. And so... Here's the adventure maps, and we're going to go over here. No, we can't go over there. We're supposed to go into other games. I've been and haven't been in this since yesterday. I should know where everything is, but I don't. So, we're going to head over here. With, they've got a new mini-games map. I was told about it yesterday. I had to try it. And so I think I'm going to try it now. A new parkour castle escape. And I'm going to join it. And you are a prisoner who must escape the castle. So, as you guys... No, I'm famously bad at these parkour maps. And this one, I'm able to get straight over to the ladder parkour and do okay at that. And I really can't get much further than the ladder. Matter of fact, I end up falling off the ladder parkour, which is absolutely horrible for me. But you guys know me. I'm just horrible at parkour maps. I have never been able to do a single parkour map and complete one to date. I want to complete this one. This one looks like it's going to be good at the end. So, ooh! <sighs> Ow. This one looks like this would be good at the end. And there's more for me to come I haven't seen yet. So I'm hoping that maybe this time, because you guys are watching me, you guys are going to be my good luck charm. Okay, you guys are my bad luck charm. I'm kidding. I'm going to hope you guys can be my good luck charm on this. I really am, because I really want to do well on this for you. And so we're not going to spend too much time on this, though, because I don't want to bore you guys to death me failing at parkour over and over again. But... Yeah, so maybe about five or ten minutes, we'll do a quick tour of Millionaire's Avenue, and that will round up today and our episode of Towncraft today. So I wanted to ask you guys a question. Where am I? Here. Oh, what the? Uh. So I want to ask you guys a question. Um, do you think I should um, be posting a schedule, like have a regular schedule for these things? For instance, say do my mini games on Monday and my Towncraft Tuesday, and some Hunger Games Wednesday, and you know what I mean. Like, instead of this, um, like, doing it random, and maybe my Vipercraft Factions Thursday. So what do you guys think? Do you think I should go that route? Because I'd be more than happy to go that route. Also, I'm looking for an SMP server from you guys. And another quick update, you guys are probably not going to like me. I think I'm going to start taking weekends off. I kind of got burnt out this last weekend. Um doing these videos for you, and don't get me wrong, I love doing these videos for you guys, I wouldn't keep doing it now if I didn't love doing these videos for you, but I kind of got burnt out a little bit, you know what I mean? So, I think what I'm going to do, and I'm sorry about this, is I'm going to take... Oh. <sighs> oh, I don't know why I put myself through this, but what I think I'm going to do is I think I'm going to start taking Saturdays and Sundays off, uh, you know, just have the weekend to myself, catch up with what I need to, and... Don't be surprised once class starts back up in the uh, fall that if my videos become less frequent. Because I do need to focus on my studies a little bit. I know you guys love watching me fail at nearly everything I try on here. But so, but I think that's what I'm going to have to do. is I'm going to have to just make these less and less frequent on the weekends. Just so, because I'm also planning to get a job at um, my college, if I can get it. Um, I've... Uh, I have my application, got to print out my resume tomorrow. Matter of fact, I might do that tonight, I'd forget off video. Um, but, like I said, I'd love to do it. Um, and I'd love to keep doing this, but 
real life does come first, guys, and as much as I love YouTube and how much it's become a part of my life, um, the past few weeks I've been doing it, again, I have to kind of do what's best for me, so don't keep stop, don't stop watching my videos, and keep subscribed to my channel, uh, leave, keep leaving those likes, because it's the positive feedback I need, and I will try to keep doing this towards, into the school year, but if I can't, then I just can't. Um, this is not saying I'm quitting. I'm going to keep doing my videos as much as I can, but it may, might be a little bit less frequent once I start class back up in the fall. So anyway, that's just uh, enough of the uh, boring depression, real life stuff. You guys don't care about that. You want to keep me, you want to see me do this parkour. You want to see it a little bit further than what I have, and how, don't you, don't you, don't you? Yeah, I thought so. Well, looks like that's gonna not going to happen. Let's try another day. For now, let's go over to Millionaire's Avenue and take a quick little tour. And we're back at my mansion. We are on Millionaire's Avenue. Number four, Millionaire's Avenue to be exact. I want to update you guys on my office. My office, I kind of switched around a little bit. So now if I place some minecart here, I can take a seat right here. And this is my office now. It's kind of a neat little thing. Uh, for now, we don't need the minecart there. I should have just left it anyway. Um, and there's my office. I still don't know what I'm going to do with this space. Um, it's been empty for a while now. I'm kind of sick of it. But I want you guys to give me tips and tricks and things you want me to put in there. Suggestions down in the comment below. And we still have the indoor pool. I still need to update that map, by the way. That's completely outdated now. Um, we still have the indoor pool. Woo! <laughs> um, which I love. Nobody else in the block has an indoor pool. Only me. Um, yeah, for instance, um, so this is the map that we have right now. There has been a lot more that's happened. For instance, down here... Uh, a little bit ways off the mall, I'm going to move this map to the town hall because a little ways off the mall, we've got town hall, we've got, yeah, and the mall's not actually completed, so we've got the town hall, we've got the library, we've got the school, which I'll be showing you all that soon. Um, so the map's outdated, I need to move it over to the town hall so we can update it a little bit. Um, nothing's really changed here in my mansion. You guys have pretty much all seen this before. If the lag can stop, please, thank you. Um, so, here's Ivy's mansion. <laughs> she still hasn't taken this down. <laughs> she still hasn't taken that down. <laughs> oh, Ivy. Shh, I hope she doesn't watch this video. <laughs> I don't remember where else I put it, but... So, we've got the hotel. The hotel is looking great. I love this hotel, um, so far. Um, the hotel looks fine, looks... And we actually have an elevator installed on the hotel. Um, I don't remember if I showed that guys in my last video or not, but we do have an elevator now. Which means we can go up to floor two. And check out the staterooms. This is the family suite. Family suite seat, which I personally think looks better with. Kidding, Ivy. I won't put that in there. <laughs> I've did it before. I was kind of funny then, but not so much funny now. Um, then we can keep going up. There's not much else to see on the other floors yet. Um, oh, that was for floor one. Didn't want to go there. So I guess we're not going to the other floors today, guys. Uh, we'll do that next episode. Um, but for now, if the frame rate can stop dropping... Uh, frame rate... You know what? I, I gotta try one more thing, because this... It's bothering me, the frame rates are so low when they should be up there, so particles decreased, um, fast, minimum, server textures, let's take the server textures off, see if that brings it up a little bit, um, so, um, the mall still looks good, um, you guys have seen the mall before, there's not much has changed, she still hasn't taken that off the mall yet, it's nice, Ivy, nice, you're just gonna leave us up forever, aren't you, <laughs> um, then over here it gets a little bit more interesting because we've got more builds going on. Some of these builds we can go into. That kind of looks like a stables down there, so... Uh, very empty one. They don't let us do this in here. we got, of course, the town hall, which hasn't changed much. we got the library right here where people can come to read. And behind that, you see the big brick building? Yes, directly behind the library we now have a school. This is the Callaway Academy for Minecraft and Nept, founded by Billy Deadkins in 1889. Okay, and we're going to fly through the... So we've got a bunch of classrooms and that kind of thing. We've got a few bathrooms. That's the male's bathroom. 
Um, she had stairs put down there that were the same color as the acacia wood, so, um, there's a toilet paper, she has to get toilet paper in every bathroom. It's kind of a dark and dreary type place, and on the other end we got the women's room, which is missing a urinal. I should put that in there, but I won't. I won't be mean. That's just too mean for me at this point. Um, we've got a whole bunch of classrooms. Um, we've got detention rooms right here. Oh, which does look like a classroom, except it doesn't have the American flag. I'll put a flag in there somewhere soon. Uh, then we're going to move up here. And we've got more classrooms. No bathrooms on the third floor, so you can only go to the bathroom if you got to go potty on the second floor. To me, this is a little bit too open. We should probably close this in a little bit, which we probably will in the future. Um, but for now, it's just open. And this might turn into a Minecraft movie later. Um, Billy Deadkins, beloved founder, 1856 to 1920. Ooh. Then over here, I helped in this build a little bit. Um, it looks like he's done some stuff on the inside, too. This is, belongs to No Pants Warrior at the moment. I think he's selling it, though. Um... We're going to go in. Um, it's number 47. Uh, I don't know who it belongs to. Um, yeah, it was currently, it was made by No Pants Warrior and myself. So, this is the latest manor on the block. I like it. It looks really amazing. And it's a little bit taller than everybody else's. But that's okay. Um, I think you should be putting a bedroom right here. Or something on the top floor, like a master suite or a hotel or something like that. Um, but it's, it looks really cool. I always love looking at these right here um diana hole <laughs> you guys are so shilly 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 um this looks like it's gonna be a mansion of some sort i hope it is anyway um that's the amusement park over there which you've seen from the outside view i'm not ready to show it off officially yet it's not done entirely um i still like that one over there i don't know if this one over here if it's a mansion or not or you know just something people are trying to build um, but the whole point of Millionaire's Avenue was not really to make a community or anything. It was supposed to be a, CS, a CMP, a creative multiplayer um, type experience, so it was basically just to get people involved, get your creative minds working and flowing, and just go out there, build your dream house, and make it a part of this wonderful community. And this guy helped in the hotel a little bit, so he kind of put his next to the hotel. Nice, you still haven't removed that ivy either. Okay, so... It's kind of modeled against Ivy's house, I guess. It looks similar. Um, and, of course, we've got the build-off comp competition. I don't mind the build-off competition being over here, but I wish it would move a little bit. I just... I wish it could move away a little bit so somebody else could have this plot or something. Or a match something with their sapphire. I love the idea of a build competition, but I just wish it would move a little bit. Because um, it's kind of close to everything on Millionaire's Avenue, so... Um, yeah, this has really been this is really a great server. Um, I'm so pleased to see where it's happened. And Ivy's house, I don't think I've ever taken an official tour of Ivy's house. So I'm going to take a drop in. I'm going to drop in on Ivy when she's not here. Um, and take a look around. And yeah. Um, I'm going to go up here. And energy drinks. I think it's supposed to be a gym type area. And then just for posterior. There you go, Ivy. <laughs> okay. Uh, but anyway, guys. Um, I only do that in good fun. She knows that. She understands that. Um, but anyway, guys. That about wraps up this episode of My Town Craft. If you liked it, leave a like and subscribe down below. I will... On the, my previous episodes, I've left a link in the description below for My Town Craft. So you guys can go ahead and check that out there. Um, it's really coming along good. I like Millionaire's Avenue, and I like how the server's developing. We have more members sort of showing up every day. And, yeah, so I hope you guys have enjoyed this. If you have, like I said before, leave a like and subscribe. Share me out to your friends. Share the love, guys, because, you know, I love all of you. You guys have been fantastic for my channel. It's always great to see new subscribers and old subscribers there, and it's nice to see more likes on the video. So, ooh, I just littered. I'm naughty. I littered. So... Like I said, leave a like and subscribe. It's, ooh, that's Kool-Aid's property. Okay. Um, always helps me out a lot to know that you guys are liking what you're seeing. And if you have any suggestions, 
make sure to leave them down in the comments below. If you have any SMP servers, also leave them down in the comments below because it really helps me out a lot. I love watching you guys watch this sh watch this, and I'm kind of beating a dead horse a little bit. So leave a like, subscribe, and I will see you tomorrow. Bye.